and now I'm under this huge mother tree of the forest and it's really nice tree and uh, as you can see the, the, root, the roots are deep there and then you'll see uh, like different plants like this this is uh, some kind of cat cattail uh, well not cattail but it's it's a prehistoric kind of it's in the family of ferns it's really old it's not cattail it's a cat a uh, horse tail i think horse tail yeah i mix up but it's it's a really ancient plant that dates back to uh, the time of the dinosaurs or apparently so or maybe earlier so it's a, it's it's cute how you see lots of different uh, diversity of of plants uh, growing here. The mother tree brings moist and uh, a, a micro habitat that uh, enables many plants to grow. As you can see, there's one over there and a different type over there. There's um, also, I think this is, a, I'm not sure, but I think this is rhubarb. Oh, I'm not sure. I think it's a small rhubarb plant. Um, I wouldn't, I'm not sure about that ID, but you see there's a mosses, the moss habitat, um, so it's very rich, a and it's the mother tree that creates that small micro habitat. And as you can see here, there's some uh, genévrier, I'm not sure what's in, in English, but it sometimes has a, a radish um, flower on top of it. So the mother tree creates these uh, microhabitats for plants to grow. And the same thing for the ditch here. Ditches are great for, uh, you know, uh, small habitats, microhabitats of the different uh, ecosystems. It's like mini ecosystems. You know, you'll find all kinds of uh, of plants in those areas, and um, I really like to go and just, you know, get see get to see things and how they work. And this here is a, it's a baby tree, I guess, and it's it's really soft. It's like it's like if it has fur almost. It's pretty cool. See, it's a really nice. Uh, <laughs> I like just to wander at the trees and see there's some uh, pine cones and um, the bench is over there so uh, there's some chickadees that you can hear probably in the background. The frogs are probably already hibernating. Oh and there's a cool plant here. Let's see this how it has uh, some kind of duv duvet. This is mulin. So mulins growing here. See, there's a a baby mulin. Yay! And you can hear the chickadees. So there's one right there. I don't know if you can see the chickadee. It's right there, like about here. It's in the it's in, it's in the leaves right there. Oh, it's gone now. <laughs> so it's the wonder of nature. And I think every day would be great to immerse ourselves for at least 30 minutes in this wonder of nature. It's amazing. It's beautiful. And uh, there's lots of chickadees around too. <laughs> 